I decided to enroll Eduardo in the International Math Challenge because I received a communication from the math teacher at school. I discussed with Eduardo and we thought it was a fun way to practice and test his skills in a safe environment and put some gaming into the boring math stuff. We received an email from our school last year. That was the first time our school signed up for this challenge. We did not know about this before that. So we wanted to give it a try because Arav had always been very excited about maths and going ahead with the most challenging exercises in his class. So his teacher recommended that we sign up for this. And we tried last time, but it was a bit of a shock for us because we had never done assessments before. We had never done any sort of exam before. And, uh, but he enjoyed uh, doing it. So this time we decided to do it again, prepare better and uh, practice some more questions, practice the past papers and take up the challenge. And uh, surprisingly, he did quite good. The teacher at school um, was very enthusiastic about Megan's um, math. And Megan also shows a lot of enthusiasm at math at school. And so the teacher encouraged her to do it. And we thought it would be wonderful for Megan to take part in such a challenge. I normally enroll and leave in any of the aptitude tests if there is an opportunity from the school or from elsewhere because it actually creates a lot of resilience in the child to be able to do different sorts of tests as they may a different skill set and that's the sole reason I want her to be exposed to different tests if they come and lead the way. Siddharth for the last few years has been taking quite a few peer exams within his but those were uh, very much limited within India. The whole pattern and the syllabus that he has been writing for those Olympiads. So because Glendale is now a select school, he uh, realized that because it's a select school, they have an option to write the International Math Olympiad Challenge. So we were quite excited because this is the first time he was participating in at an international level. Uh, so that was the main reason. So to test him at an international level and also the syllabus and everything else is quite different from what he has been learning at school. Uh, so that would also give him the extra mileage of critical problem solving and also learn something new apart from what he has been doing. So these were the two main factors uh, that has made me enroll him in this exam. I enrolled Rodrigo in the International Maths Challenge with the aim of not only challenging his mathematical skills, but also cultivating a, a global perspective on the uh, subject. Uh, the competition serves him uh, as a platform to expose uh, through diverse problem-solving approaches, uh, enhancing his analytical thinking. Uh, additionally, per, uh, by participating in this international challenge, Rodrigo has the chance to interact with young minds from various cultures and backgrounds, creating a rich learning environment. This experience goes uh, beyond academic growth. This experience gives him a sense of curiosity, adaptability, and inspire him to be a lifelong learner, especially in math. math. So actually, Hannah has big interest in the math since she was young. So she always liked to study math and she would like to attend some, to participate in some math competitions. This is something we would like to encourage her to participate.